Most of us don't think about it, but the ocean covers about 70% of our planet. Now, we may get excited when we see something that is alive in the ocean, when we get a good fish, but there's so many more species in the ocean. There's corals, there's sponges, there's microbes, and there's phytoplankton, there's so many. In, in truth, we don't really even know how many species there are in the ocean. Some people think that there is about a million species. Some other things there may be up to 10 million species. But we have not even named about 250,000 of these as actual species. So why are these important? So the biodiversity of the ocean is important because we derive our health and our economy from it. I mean, we depend on the life on the ocean so much. It's incredible. Uh, for example, there is only perhaps about 4,000 species of phytoplankton out in the world's ocean. Yet, that's about only a quarter of the freshwater species of phytoplankton. The ocean phytoplankton, however, make about half of the oxygen that we breathe out in the atmosphere today. We also derive other benefits from biodiversity. We derive cement with which we build buildings and streets and even ships. We may derive medicine from corals and special sponges. Now, it's, that's where the secret of biodiversity is that we need to really keep in mind. All of these species are in the ocean. The more we look, the more we find that there's some benefit for us. And so what we would like to do is keep that for the future. We would like to have future generations benefit from that richness in biology and, and life in the ocean. So the United Nations uh, Sustainable Development Goals, there's one that really tries to focus on the biodiversity and the benefits that the ocean provides for us. That's goal number 14. They would like us to think about how do we conserve some of these resources so that we continue development in a sustainable fashion. We need to address overfishing. We need to address things like the acidification of the ocean that is taking place because of the greenhouse gases that we're putting in the atmosphere. So I invite you to look at the ocean as a resource, as a living thing that we depend on, to know more about it, and to take care of it together.